Dear Marie Antoinette, How dare you suggest I eat cake? I am gluten intolerant. Yours outraged of Paris. I did not say let them eat cake. I said, have a break, have a Kit Kat. It was a sponsorship deal. I cannot believe they are taking this so seriously. To Marie Antoinette, you are an Austrian slag. I have done a rude drawing to show this. Oh, oh, what is, how is, oh, it's my foot. I did not imagine you could put that there. That's impressive, actually. Your Royal Highness, you are now behind in your monthly installment payments for your diamond necklaces. If you do not pay, we will have no choice but to close your account. <laughs> okay, but they will not close the account because <laughs> I just closed them. I love getting these letters. They're like, oh, please pay all your massive debts. And I'm like, <laughs> or what? You will, what will you, you will do nothing. So funny. I love being the queen. To the Queen, you and your family are nothing but leeches, vain baubles, parasites on France. One day we shall rise up and get rid of you. Oh, they say this every year they have a poll in the newspapers, should we get rid of the road? But they won't do it. They will never do it. We are too good for tourism, okay? No one will ever visit Versailles if no one lives in it. <laughs> to the Austrian slapper, you are a terrible example for the young fee of France. How will they grow up with realistic expectations of their bodies if you are walking around with seven foot high hair and eight foot wide hips? You are a terrible role model. I have never said that these are natural, first of all. I've always admitted these are enhancements. You cannot get eight foot wide hips naturally. That's obvious. And I have never said I am a role model. I think they should look to other public female figures, you know, like... Like, like the Virgin Mary, for example. Dear Marie Antoinette, you are a massive whore. Please stop having so much sex. Also, please have lots of children soon. I don't, I don't know what they want me to do. 